Mac Fleckno, is a satirical poem written by John Dryden during the 17th century. The poem utilizes a mock heroic style, adopting the grand language and structure of epic poetry to satirize a seemingly trivial subject the selection of a successor in the realm of nonsense. At the heart of the satire is Thomas Shadwell, a contemporary poet whom Dryden criticizes for his perceived lack of talent and originality. Characterization of Mac Fleckno and the Kingdom of Nonsense The poem opens by introducing Mac Fleckno, the aging king of the realm of nonsense. Mac Fleckno, representing mediocrity and dullness, decides to pass on his dubious crown to a successor who will continue the tradition of producing uninspiring poetry. This kingdom of nonsense serves as an allegory for the state of poetry at the time, with Dryden personifying the decline in literary standards. Selection of Thomas Shadwell as the heir After considering various candidates, Mac Flecknoe settles on Shadwell as the ideal heir to the throne of nonsense. The poem then shifts to a detailed critique of Shadwell's poetic abilities. Dryden employs humor and satire to ridicule Shadwell's works, emphasizing their lack of wit, creativity, and poetic skill. The choice of Shadwell as the successor becomes a focal point for Dryden's broader commentary on the degradation of literary quality. Mock Heroic Style and Irony A key feature of Mac Fleckno is its use of a mock heroic style. By applying the elevated language and grandiosity associated with epic poetry to the selection of a poet of little merit, Dryden introduces irony into the satire. The stark contrast between the grandiose style and the unimpressive subject matter enhances the humorous and critical elements of the poem. Ridicule of Shadwell's Poetry The poem continues to lampoon Shadwell, providing specific examples from his works to highlight the perceived deficiencies. Shadwell's lack of originality, wit, and artistic depth are portrayed vividly, and Dryden's use of detailed criticism adds weight to the satire. The ridicule of Shadwell serves not only as a personal attack, but also as a commentary on the broader decline in poetic standards during the Restoration period. Historical and Literary Context Mac Flecknoe is situated within the historical and literary context of the Restoration period. Dryden, a prominent figure in the literary landscape, uses satire to engage in broader debates within the literary community. The poem reflects the social, political, and cultural changes of the time and becomes a vehicle for Dryden's commentary on the perceived decline in poetic quality and the rise of mediocrity. Legacy and Influence Despite its specific historical context, Mac Flecknoe has endured as a classic work of satirical poetry. Its clever use of language, humor, and the mock heroic style has inspired subsequent poets and writers. The poem's impact extends beyond its immediate target, Thomas Shadwell, as it addresses timeless themes related to the ongoing struggle between artistic merit and mediocrity in the realm of literature. In conclusion, Mac Flecknoe is a multifaceted satirical masterpiece that combines humor, allegory, and a mock heroic style to deliver a scathing critique of contemporary poetry while also engaging with broader issues within the literary landscape of its time.